Hello, dear friends. Let's take a little journey together, a journey inward. We'll find peace and comfort in the words of Psalm 23. This is a five minute retreat for your soul. Life gets so busy, doesn't it? It's easy to feel overwhelmed, but God offers us a place of peace, a place of rest. Let's find that place together right now. Imagine yourself by a tranquil lake, the water calm and still. Feel the gentle breeze on your face, the warmth of the sun on your skin. Close your eyes and take a deep breath. Let go of all your worries and stress. In this moment, you are safe, you are loved, and you are at peace. Allow the words of Psalm 23 to wash over you, bringing you comfort and serenity. Let's embark on this peaceful journey together and find solace in the presence of God. Find a comfortable spot. Close your eyes if you feel comfortable. Take a deep breath. Let the tension melt away. Now let's bring to mind the words of Psalm 23. These words are a balm for our souls, a soothing melody for our hearts. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. Can you picture that? Green pastures, a gentle breeze. The shepherd leads us to a place of rest. He wants us to be restored. Let his peace wash over you. Restoration and righteousness, his gentle guidance. He leads me beside quiet waters. He restores my soul. He guides me in paths of righteousness for his namesake. Sometimes we feel lost, don't we? But the shepherd is always with us, guiding us, leading us beside those quiet waters. He restores our souls and sets us on the right path. Walking through the valley, facing fears with faith. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. Life has its valleys, doesn't it? Times of fear, times of uncertainty. But even in those dark valleys, we are not alone. The shepherd is right beside us, comforting us, protecting us. When we face our fears, it's easy to feel overwhelmed, to feel like the darkness is closing in. But remember, the light always finds a way through. The shepherd's presence is a beacon, guiding us, giving us strength. Each step we take, no matter how small, is a step towards faith, a step towards hope. The valleys are not the end of our journey, they are a part of it. They shape us, teach us, and ultimately, they lead us to greener pastures. So hold on to faith, embrace the journey, and trust that you are never alone. Goodness and mercy, a lifetime with the shepherd. From the break of dawn to the setting sun, the shepherd's presence is a constant comfort. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies, a feast of abundance and grace, even when surrounded by challenges. You anoint my head with oil, my cup overflows. This anointing signifies honor, blessing, and the overflowing abundance of his love. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, like a gentle breeze that never ceases, bringing comfort and peace. And I shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Goodness and mercy, this eternal promise is a sanctuary for our souls. These are the blessings that follow us all the days of our lives. In every step we take, in every moment we live, his blessings are with us. The shepherd provides for us, protects us, and guides us through the valleys and peaks of life. He pours out his love upon us like the sun pouring its warmth on a cold day, filling our hearts with his divine presence. Let's rest in that promise. Take another deep breath. Hold on to this peace. Feel the tranquility that comes from knowing we are never alone. The Lord is our shepherd. We shall not want. In his care we find everything we need and more. His provision is endless, his love boundless. <laughs> 